I'm gonna prove how dangerous I am because trust me, in the mindset I'm in, I'm really, really dangerous. This man is not, it's not gonna be pretty what's gonna happen to this man in here. I don't like that guy as much as I want to. I can't wait to beat the crap out of him later on this year. So, and uh, I think it's gonna happen. Here we go again. I'm back, you know what I mean? So let's go. Bum, bum, bum. This is the fight that I want, it's a fight that he wants, it's a fight that I think the world wants, so, you know, any venue, any weight class, whenever. I'm throwing kill shots now. Every shot I have thrown in this camp is a kill shot. So, you know, that's it, I'm gonna kill this man. I'll fight a 185, I'll fight a 170. If Dana steps in, and I've heard him talk about 155, if Dana steps in and gets his way, possibly it's 155. 185. <laughs> <laughs> Training's going great. The leg is bouncing back. The body is strong. My energy levels are high. You know, I'm getting this hunger to be committed. Yeah. You know, so everything's moving in the right direction. Uh, at the right time also, yeah. you know what I mean? So I'm excited to go. It would make a lot of sense for us to fight in September. I hope it's a September, and I think we, I think it's, I think this fight is too big to do T-Mobile Arena. I think we sell out Allegiant Stadium or Dallas Cowboy Stadium. He's not fought someone like me. I fought someone like him, though. It'll be my job now on, on, on fight night to show the levels and show there is much, you know, there's a much higher difference in skill level here, and that's that's it. I'm eager to get back, you know what I mean? I'm eager to get back and get going. I would love it for be, to be at 170. I think Connor's calling it for, for it to be at 170, so I'm definitely down for 170. He, he mentioned 185. I think he was kind of trying to call, trying to see if I would call his bluff. I'm down for 185. I'll fight him wherever, I don't care. Connor and I are gonna show up on the same weight, regardless of the weight class, it doesn't matter. Uh, I think I'm just gonna slice through him. I think I'm a little too slicey for, 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 <laughs> for, for him than, than, than anyone else he's fought. A little too snappy and whippy. And I think I'll slice through him. I want Connor at his, his biggest and his baddest and his best, you know? I'd like it at 170. I think it's well documented. He wants it at 170. I want him to be 100% healthy. Um, 
I've seen him obviously physically and moving around and stuff. He looks like the leg is healing up great, which is great to hear. Um, he deserves to come back 100%. And we give the we give the world what, what they deserve, and that's a, a knockdown drag out war on pay per view later on this year. And I'm hoping for September. We'll see. Lights don't get any brighter and the stage does not get any bigger than fighting Conor McGregor. And that's the fight that I've wanted. Um, obviously, Conor wanted it enough to, to come here and do this. And I think uh, now we have gotten enough time of spending enough time with each other that I think we want to fight each other even more now than we did before. So, you know, it's uh, there's a ton of respect for him, his entire team, what he's done here. Um, and yeah, whatever weight class, wherever. I would love it to be in Vegas. I've been signed with the organization now almost two and a half years. I haven't fought in Vegas. There's not, a, there's, not, there's not a man alive that can come on this soil and be me. Next for me is I'm gonna go backstage.